Hey gang, Scott here. A quick video on my pet peeve with the Lightroom basic panel and the way that it's laid out. And it's that the auto button is before the camera profile. And uh, you've, if you haven't noticed when I'm ever I'm doing you know, videos and I'm starting off from scratch, I'm choosing a profile and then I'm going and hitting the auto button. And there's a reason for that because the auto button takes into account what the profile has already done to your photo. You're choosing a profile like an initial treatment of your image, even of your raw data and how it's going to be presented. And that can be anything from brightness to color and you know, all, all sorts of things can happen with that profile. The auto button is working you know, from that point of view. So if your, your workflow is you're, you're hitting auto and then you're changing the profile, well, you really ought to go back and hit auto again because uh, the first auto is uh, taking into account the old profile. I'll show you really quickly what I mean here. Well, this photo here, uh, you know, no uh, meaningful adjustments have been made. A little crop, uh, retouched something, uh, and the basics have been untouched. The default profile is Adobe Color. Now, auto is right at the top. Now, normally we, we kind of work top down when we're, we're working through basics. So, you know, I, I see photographers, they'll hit auto. Great. Now, let's take a note of these numbers here. We've got, okay, 0.22, 50, 60, 10. Okay, nice, so we've got some, some good round numbers we can remember, 50, 60, 10, let's remember that. And then you're coming here and saying, let me change my camera profile to say landscape. I'm gonna get a little bit richer colors and you know, things are just a little more uh, deeper. You know, there's a little more contrast. None of the tonal changes have uh, been uh, uh, readjusted, right? Now, if I hit auto again, right now, notice the change. Uh, these things are different. You know, I'll undo that change. I'll hit auto again. Now, why is that happening? That's because auto is taking into account what the profile has already done, right? So if I reset all of these things and I go back to Adobe Color, this is where we began, and if I said, let me do my landscape first, my auto second, I'm getting all of the things here. And it's, I would like the profile to be the first thing because that's the, the I think the correct order to do things in. And it's, is it a big deal? No, it's not a big deal, but I don't know. I'm just in one of those moods where this has been a pet peeve and it's, you know, it's something um, I wanna make sure you're aware of. You know, if you're hitting auto, then changing the profile, Go back and visit that auto uh, if you're if you're using auto to get your your basic settings. It, again, is this is this like you know like a, a grand epiphany of photography? No, of course not. Um, I'm I'm almost griping a little bit at this point. So who knows? Maybe we'll see them flip the order of those things there. But now you know that auto is going to be accounting uh, taking into account your camera profile selection. Got any questions? Go ahead and drop them below. Got any other pet peeves about Lightroom? Go ahead and drop them below too. And until next time, my name's Scott Davenport. Have fun.